information tonight in the attempted theft of an ATM machine that led to a manhunt. Now, this happened at an Overland Park Walgreens early this morning. KMBC News Peggy Bright is there live at 126th and Flum. Peggy? Well, then one man was brought in for questioning in the case, but he has been released tonight. The ATM machine is right inside the front door here of this Walgreens. Now, the alarms went off early this morning, which alerted police. Then the alarm company called police to say they could see two men inside the building trying to get the ATM. Officers arrived as the van was speeding away. The van was found abandoned in a resident's driveway not far from here. It turns out it had just been stolen. That's when swarms of officers began looking for the suspects throughout the neighborhood. Bill Warner says the police were, did their search and he did his own too. You know, we have a, a rear entrance into the house uh, below ground. I wanted to make sure there wasn't anybody hiding down there. Checked to make sure there weren't any broken windows into the garage and things. So we cleared our house and then waited to see what happened. Investigators believe there were three suspects in this case, including one who was a driver. Only one, though, was captured, and that's the one who was released. Now, police have not released any surveillance pictures of the crime. We're live in Overland Park. Peggy Bright, KMBC 9 News. The van Peggy was talking about had been stolen from an apartment complex. The van was processed for evidence, and then returned to its owner.